Hello, my name is George and in today's video I'm going to tell you how and why you should uninstall the most recent update uh, from Microsoft. Um, Microsoft has already retracted uh, this update. It is called KB4524244. Um, it was released on February 11th and it was pulled off um, uh, on February 15th of uh, 2020. So... Not everyone goes ahead and installs the latest Windows updates, but um, yeah, this one you should definitely install if you've already installed it. And I actually installed it. I didn't have any issues with it personally um, on none of the PCs that I have here, not on my laptop, not on my stream PC, not on my desktop PC. Um, but it looks like, um, yeah, there's user reports about freezes, boot problems, uh, installation issues. So... Uh, one of the main ones I've heard from a couple of people is, is that uh, they'll get in a uh, boot loop where they'll get the troubleshooting options, you know, to put the PC into like troubleshooting mode or, um, for example, like uh, put your PC into safe mode or whatever, and then they won't be able to get in Windows and stuff like that. So, yeah, and I've heard of people getting freezes and stuff. So, yeah, it looks like this is a pretty known and widespread issue now. Um, so as of February 15th, Microsoft has went ahead and pulled it and you cannot, um, get this update from Microsoft anymore. Uh, yeah, so that's a good thing. Um, it wasn't a good thing that they're using us as a test bed to, um, uh, to test out all these new windows updates. So, but this is, it is, it is what it is. So we got what we got and I'm just telling you right now, um, you should definitely go and uninstall this windows update if you already have it installed and uh the way you can do that is very simple okay so this uh this video will tell you how you can uninstall it and it'll also tell you if you even have it installed so don't worry for those of you that don't even have it installed you don't even have to delete it or uninstall it from your system um so first things first i'll get the magnifier out right here so it's easier to see um, you go into and click into your search bar and then you type in view window view my update history so you just type in view and then click on the view update history and then you go down to where it says um, uninstall updates and then you can see right here in this case I have not gone through the trouble of uninstalling this yet but it is a security update for Microsoft Windows KB452, uh, 4524244, so KB452444, and I do still have it, uh, I still do have it installed, so the objective is, is to uninstall it. So once you go in and uh, you look for yourself, um, yeah, you'll just go here and you'll see it if you have it installed. If you don't have it installed, don't worry. Um, don't even worry about it. So the way that you uninstall this is is you go right here to where it says security update for Microsoft Windows and then you find the correct one KB4524244 right click it and then click the uninstall button and then I don't believe uh, I got any prompt for re uh, for restarting my PC or anything um, sometimes you uninstall security update uh, Windows will require you to uh, go ahead and restart your PC, but I didn't have that um, on any of my other PCs. But just for safe measure, I would highly re advise you to go ahead and restart Windows after you have uninstalled this. So yeah, like I said, it's a, um, it's a common issue uh, for a lot of people, these boot freezes, uh, loading freezes, blue screen, uh, just go ahead and uninstall it and it should resolve your issues if it has anything to do with these symptoms um, that most people are seeing. So I think that's pretty much it for this. Um, yeah, just get it done. Um, there's no reason to have this on your PC right now. So even if you're someone like me that doesn't have any issues with this, it's still highly advisable that you go ahead and get it off of your system. So I think um, that's it. Um, if you have any uh, comments or questions, please put them in the comment section below. Please, in the, 
please like and subscribe on this video if you enjoy my content. I try to put up content every day. I know that I haven't been good about that recently, and I apologize for that, but I'm going to get back on it and start doing more. Um, if you want to come and chat with me uh, live, I go live every day on Mixer. Um, Cash Me Out 2, same as my, um, same as my uh, YouTube name. Go ahead and, um, yeah, go in the chat. And ask me whatever questions you want. If this video uh, doesn't make any sense to you, you can ask me, and I'll be glad to uh, I'll be glad to answer your questions. So that's it for me. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.